All right, so this video is going to be on the Jordan 4 Military Black. I mean, the reason why I'm making this video is because a lot of people already started receiving their pairs, and I kind of want to go over the resale value on this shoe and what I'm expecting on this shoe to, you know, to um, to resale for um, in the market. So here's one pair. I think this is this is a size eight. Um, yeah, up in person, like I, this shoe is, this shoe is dope. Like I just, <laughs> I, I'm kind of like bummed out. I didn't get a a size eleven. Um, that's my that's my size. I don't know why I got super dark, but yeah. Um, this shoe is super dope. We're just gonna go over the resale value. I'm gonna compare it to the Oreos, uh, just because the Oreos is kind of, it kind of reminds me of the Oreos. It's just a simple colorway. I know the Oreos were um, black, uh, white, and uh, of course you know the oreo colorway with just like black dots um but besides that it kind of reminds me of the oreos i think they're just going to perform the same um a lot of people are holding this shoe um what i've seen in instagram are just a lot of people are going to be holding the shoe um this is just one of those shoes kind of like the pandas where it's just you know it's a simple it's clean black and white uh you can wear it with any fit all right um just like i mentioned before uh, we're gonna go ahead and compare the military black with the Oreos um, just for the reason for just because they're kind of similar in the colorway now for the Oreo these dropped last year on July 3rd of 2021 as you can see here now if we go around that date we see that uh, Risa was around 282 um, it wasn't that bad but we definitely saw an increase in price so the longer that you held the maximum that your profits were um, if we want to see the all-time high, that's going to be around January. Um, we saw an all-time high of a 505. I don't know, actually February 5, 5, 5, 512. So it did take a couple of months for the Jordan 4 Oreos to see the all-time high. Now, am I going to be holding for, you know, this amount of time? No, I'm not. Let's go to the military black and see how they are performing. All right, so here we have the military black um like i mentioned it's for me it kind of reminds me a lot of the oreo so i i do believe it's going to perform the same um so for this one uh we kind of see a steady decline and that's kind of you know to be expected because of the uh the initial drop on may 21st and then uh as of now i've only seen two restocks that i know of um, and it hasn't affected the price so much, but what's going to affect the price is when people start getting their pairs and start reselling. So, um, as of right now, we are seeing a 73% price, uh, premium, which is not that bad. Um, not so much volatility and the number of sales, we got around $12,000, um, 12,000, <laughs> uh, we have around 12, almost 13,000, uh, number in sales, which is not that bad. And just like I mentioned, I don't be holding, I was able to cop. Um, a few pairs myself um, on the initial and restock number one um, I'll show my success so you guys know I'm not lying <laughs> um, this is gonna be for the restock number one uh, for restock number two I was not able to cop any just because that happened when I was working and uh, I believe it was through Union um, I was notified like 10 minutes before um, I didn't have time to set up <laughs> that's not enough time for me to set up my bot and and go for a restock um so i kind of let it slide um didn't even think about it uh but this one was for jd sports uh this was going to be for the first restock this is going to be for let me pull up the date um uh, for may 24th um so this drop i think it was may 21st if i'm not mistaken so it happened like three days after um i got a lot of payment declines um I'm not sure why it's not with my credit card. If it was with my credit cards, I wouldn't receive not one single pair from this site. Um, I think it has to do with the um, uh, with my address and uh, jigging, or even with my uh, virtual credit cards. Um, so I kind of have to uh, test some things and uh, see what works. Because as of right now, uh, you're about to see I got a lot of declines. So. Uh, we got three declines, one checkout, one decline, one checkout, one decline, and then three checkouts. 
I uh, got three declines, one checkout, three, four, five, six, seven, seven declines, and then two checkouts, and then one other decline. So I got more declines than I got checkouts. Now, I'm not really, um, I'm not about to complain about the number of checkouts I received. I think I got a total of eight checkouts for JD Sports. Um, but the amount of declines that I got, I was just not too happy about it. But I'm going to be leaving it there, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys going to be holding, selling, buying more pairs? Yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm going to leave it there. You guys have a good night or a good morning, good afternoon, wherever you guys are at. Uh, you guys have a blessed day. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.